guys had a poor shooting performance, but pulled through in the end. What did it take down the stretch? Um, I think it was just our leaders, our senior leaders. They really brought us together and made sure that we were focused and on the same page. And from MK to Nick to JT, you know, they just kept telling us to get stops, and I think that eventually helped us pull through. Does the undefeated thing come into play at all for you guys now? I mean, like each game. I mean, we hear it, but we don't really focus on it. We just take it one game at a time, and it really starts in practice. You know, making sure you have everything down and you're learning all the things you need to learn to be successful for that game. Next up, you've got uh, Houston tomorrow, big in-state rival. Are you guys doing anything special to prepare for that game? Uh, no, we're doing just what we've been doing. You know, we'll, we've been watching film on them. We're going to watch more from the day, go over their stuff in practice, and just make sure we're prepared as possible. Is playing an in-state rival, though, you know, hold a little extra weight going into it? Um, I, I'm sure it is, but, you know, we're taking every opponent like, like they're the best. So, you know, we're trying to knock them off. So. You said you don't really focus on the undefeated thing, and Coach Brown says he doesn't want to focus on rankings, but you did climb to number eight today. How hard is it to resist thinking about that kind of thing and talking about it among yourselves? Um, you don't really have time to focus on it because you have to realize that you have a target on your back now and everybody's gunning for you. Everybody's going to give you their best shot. So, you know, you just got to stay focused and really take it one game at a time and try to, you know, forget about all the distractions. Can you tell the teams are like that, the opponents are like that playing y'all? Uh, yeah, you can, you can see, you know, people are a little more juiced up. You know, they're ready to go, ready to play. The uh, crowd is uh, enthusiastic and stuff like that. So. The offense didn't start too fast in, in New Orleans yesterday. What can you do differently to get a faster start um, tomorrow? I think, you know, just got to start, and, you know, start faster, you know, be more juiced up, really. That's all I can really say, you know. It doesn't help that Nick was out of the game, but there's no, no, there's no excuse for that. We got to be ready to play. Um, feed our bigs more, cut, move, and just, you know, pick up the pace. It seems like rebounding, I mean, regardless of it's a guard or forward, whoever, mm -hmm. that seems to carry you guys through, even if you're shooting poorly. What is it about this team that's such a good rebounding team? Um, I think, you know, our bigs do a tremendous job of fighting and working hard and making sure they're getting the right position. And I think, you know, our bigs will, and our coaches will get on us cars about how we need to rebound more. And as soon as we do that, you know, it's one less pass we have to make and we can just head out on a fast break.